has kicked the horse's ass. Even through that ridiculously small window, you look smug. Oh, I am, mate, because I won. And it matters. It does matter. That's the annoying thing. It really matters. <laughs> It was, a real, it was a privilege, wasn't it? That's right. Yeah. A couple of things I think you forgot to mention in that film. The Kuntash. The steering feels like it's set in concrete, so does the gear lever, so do the pedals, and if you use the air conditioning, it's like you're being breathed on by a hot dog. <laughs> he is right about that. Yeah, and you can't talk either because you roly-poly barge Testarossa was, as you said, driven by a man from Miami Vice who rolled his jacket sleeves up. Mm. Duke of Edinburgh doesn't do that, does he? Oh, now, he doesn't now do hang that. on a minute. What? By attacking those cars, you are destroying the very foundations of everything we love and hold precious. Mm -hmm. And now it's time to destroy them a little bit more by seeing how slowly those cars go round the Ebola drone. And it's off in a clutch slipping, smoky start. And oh, it's wet. And look at that lunging and pitching there. As she heads on to the isn't. Having a look at the gear lever, make sure it hasn't fallen off. Sleeves very sensibly rolled down. Look at the body roll on it. Okay, here we are. Oh, she's fighting the wheel there. More lead as she lunges down to your name here. It really is dodge, duck, dip, dive. It's like watching dodgeball, only slower and less amusing. Right, another glance down at the gear lever, and now ringing out that flat 12. Power boating back towards old lady's house in a wake of spray. Can't imagine she's enjoying this. Right, hard on the brakes, taking a wisely cautious line in there as it stopped. No, still moving, just. And now, yeah, lumbering towards substation. In fairness, it does sound quite good. Very good, actually. Yeah, wallowing through there like a Rolls-Royce Corniche. Just field of sheep to go. And it's, yes, it's like...